AFFF side effects, health risks, and cancers. Individuals who were exposed to toxic firefighting foam and subsequently developed cancer or other related illnesses are filing AFFF firefighting foam lawsuits against manufacturers. Perfluoroalkyl and polyfluoroalkyl substances, PFAS, chemicals used in the manufacturing of some AFFF firefighting foams have been linked to severe health conditions such as kidney and testicular cancer, thyroid disease, liver damage, immune system deficiencies, and more. Aqueous film forming foam may contain toxic chemicals. Perfluoroalkyl and polyfluoroalkyl substances, PFAS chemicals, are known for their resistance to heat, oil, and water, making them effective in suppressing and extinguishing flammable liquid fires. However, these so-called forever chemicals have gained attention due to their persistent nature and potential adverse health effects. The Environmental Protection Agency EPA, is concerned about the potential human health risks of exposure to PFAS chemicals since they can contaminate water, air, soil, and food sources. Traces of these toxic chemicals have also been found in the bloodstream of both humans and animals. The toxic substances present in AFFF, particularly PFAS, have been associated with the development of cancerous cells. Understanding the potential cancers that may arise from AFFF exposure is essential, as early detection and treatment are crucial for improving outcomes. Exposure to PFAS-containing firefighting foam may be linked to the following cancers. Exposure to AFFF can lead to immediate side effects, affecting different parts of the human body. These AFFF side effects may manifest shortly after exposure and can vary in severity depending on the individual's sensitivity and duration of exposure. Skin and eye irritation. Respiratory issues and breathing difficulties. Gastrointestinal problems. Neurological symptoms. Several groups of individuals are at a higher risk of PFAS exposure due to the nature of their occupations or proximity to locations where AFFF firefighting foam products are heavily used. Military firefighters and personnel. Firefighters and first responders. Airport and industrial workers. Communities near areas with high AFFF usage. If you have been affected by AFFF exposure and subsequently developed cancer or related illnesses, it is crucial to consult with experienced firefighting foam lawyers to protect your rights and pursue justice. They can help you hold responsible parties accountable and seek compensation for the damages caused by AFFF exposure. Qualified firefighting foam attorneys are experienced in AFFF litigation and can provide guidance, support, and representation throughout the legal process. If you or a loved one were exposed to toxic firefighting foam and subsequently developed cancer or other health problems, you may be eligible to file an AFFF lawsuit. Contact Tor Horman Law today for a free consultation with the best AFFF lawyers. You can also use the chatbot on the page to find out if you qualify for the AFFF firefighting foam lawsuit instantly.